Welcome back to some Super Auto Pets. Here's we are in the free pack. Show me a cricket. This is going to be controversial. Worked out for us. I don't think we wanted it on our own otter. But it's just necessary. It's, al it's almost always necessary to have three pets out there. Like maybe you can combine your otters if you're bothering like a fish or something. Um... But two 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 and then a four three. I think we're gonna have to hope for a tie here. Maybe the horse should be in the front. And that's a win actually. Sixty six point six repeating, of course, chance to win. All there is tie, so a fine squad, cricket, ant, and then give me a B on the cricket. I mean, the one twos with the otters, significantly worse than the two twos. But we found our cricket, and we found our bee, and we're going up against a 7-3 mosquito. So, I think it's safe to call this one a win. A team that was worried about losing uh, round one is now 2-0. and A great place to be in. All right. I just respect an early uh, an early rabbit significantly. I think it's very good. Okay, draft behind a ant. Interesting. Now that's formidable. That went on pretty much the best things, but we will tie, which so I'm all about ties in the first four rounds. Everyone knows this about me. We'll love a swan in here. So we will place the otter for a swan. Only a little bit. Hmm. You know what? It's our most significant unit right now. That that's pretty much a commit a commitment to this dodo. So hopefully we can find something that works with a dodo, perhaps a crab. We'd love to see some crabs right now. Some cupcakes. Due to the rabbit, the cupcakes actually do give us four extra uh, health, and then the crab copies the health right from the dodo, and then gets the attack from the dodo. That's what I call a nice symbiotic relationship. Hmm. What the heck? I mean, it's like one of my favorite units. I kind of like have to. But I am confused by it. I guess we kind of do something like this. Let me just freeze the whole shop real quick. Don't mind me. Like we committed to the... Perhaps the pufferfish is just here for now. I don't know. Maybe we would have been a lot better off if I had the power to ignore that pufferfish. But I cle clearly did not. We don't want him to hit, yeah, double hit on him. Uh, I actually be only needed one, but it doesn't matter. We stay winning. I'm worried about the future of our team due to like the direct split. Like there's the there's the dodo way, and then there's like the blowfish way. Fine with that. I would like some melon armor on my hippo, and perhaps I will even sell the blowfish to do it, which might be crazy, but it's just it's too tempting for me when it's on my team. I love a blowfish build. That's a big old peacock. Our blowfish kind of saves us here. 
And we're halfway home already. We'd love to see this. I mean, when when it just presents itself to you like this. There's like a, maybe a space for a, like these guys are level one. Like maybe it's like not a food build. Maybe it's like penguin. Cause like otter's fine, but like how am I going to guarantee those otter stats go on my dodo? as consistently as I was as I would like them to oh it could have been like almost anything except for badger I mean not that we have any problem with the rest of his team but that was quite lucky for him six wins do this love to see that love to see that throw me a penguin in here Roll me one time. I thought about like selling the rabbit just to get another swan out there. But the swan can chill for now. It's perhaps I, I will I'd be mad if I sold my rabbit and then like a couple of salads showed up next turn. Then what would I what would I possibly do? I mean this dodo's helping our hip out so much. I mean look at him. Just watch him go. Seven wins. All right, so we do want this. Obviously, we would like that will help. We would like our hippo to become a level two unit if we're going to become a penguin buffin kind of team. Right now, it's, a, it's got 17 health. It's got a ton of attack from the Dodo and Melon Armor. Like, it's pretty much got a guarantee at least one cycle of buffs. I mean, it's like on average getting through like the first four units of the other team. Eight wins. Give me this. This is a rare case where I'm not going to add a Skunk, I think. Unless, unless I absolutely am going to add a Skunk. I was like thinking about it. I'm like, what if someone's got like a really big, like, let's say a worm or something. One, one on these two guys is cute. Give me three, three on the hippo. How about that? Like buffing the dodo is a little bit more efficient, but oh, this is not the, this is not the team to run a summon build against. Star Destroyer 01. We're not quite gaining health at the rate that you're uh, spitting it out, but we might as well be. And finally, he goes down. Wow. Nine wins. Could we do it? Could we do it? That's for you, just in case. I mean... <laughs> I don't even think we're going to need it. Look at this thing. Look at this hippo. Level 1 hippo. Yeah, we rock right through this thing. No problem. It's the easiest 10 win run of my entire life. Turn 11. I think we must have had a tie in there around like 3 or 4 or something. But I mean, look at this. Level 2 Swan will never get the credit he deserves, just giving us more gold than we knew what to do with. These guys were added relatively late. The monkey probably gave the hippo probably like 9 9 ish, maybe 12 12. No, probably 9 9 if I had to guess. We just buffed the dodo early, and it just it kind of stopped getting buffs, but it kind of stopped mattering. Because then we just buffed the hippo directly, and level one was plenty enough to get it done. So yeah, I mean, early hippo, absolutely worth an early commit if it shows up. I mean, the rest of the team around it doesn't even have to be that strong.
Of course, there's something to be said for the Dodo as well. But, wow. What a squad. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. It's actually our first, uh, or our second perfect round in maybe as many days. Let's check the Hall. Turn 11, look at these. Yeah, look at these three right here. All perfect squads right here. We had two perfect squads two days ago, and then we had another perfect today. This one was in 10 rounds. This one's in 11. So not quite our best uh, run of the week, but very close. Maybe our most surprising, I'd say.